Talk a little bit about the concepts in half guard here, right? So whenever I'm playing from half guard, I don't want to be flat on my back with my face getting smashed in. So this is like a possible spot, the worst spot that I can be in half guard, right? My goal when I play half guard is I'm going to want to be playing from my side. This is ideally where we're going to set up for this position, which is our knee shield position, right? Well, it's a knee shield on top and on the bottom is a half guard because I actually want to keep that leg hooked. I don't want to just let her be free here so she can stand back up again. I actually want her down here where this one is hooking her in and this one's kind of pushing her away so she can't really smash into me. My knee, I'm gonna make sure my knee's not here where she's gonna sprawl on me. I'm also gonna make sure my knee's not so far wide where she can get her whole elbow in and start winning my hips. Okay, so that's a constant battle right here. So we're gonna practice getting to this position, right? From terrible half guard right here, I'm gonna pump, recover, get my knee shield. So far so good. I'm gonna start opening that lapel, and that's the same lapel I'm gonna come up and feed. Turn this way three so they can see my foot. No, nope, turn the other way. Right, this is gonna be important. I'm going from my half guard here to my half guard here. And then I'm able to come up on my knees. We'll start driving it. Now walk around sweep, but with the lapel variation in there. Starting all the way from a really bad half car, so we practice. Pump it in, frame, knee comes in, open the lapel, push, pipe from my underhook, coming up and feed it. After I feed it, coming up, hook the leg. Right now, I can come up to my knees. Once I'm up on my knees, that dog fight, use your hips and keep driving in, walking all the way around them. Give me your weight and on them. Let's give it a try. One, three. One, two, three.